Hey guys, Axel Nerd here, back with another video for you guys today. Today is actually the day after my birthday when uploading this, but my birthday when recording this. So I'm seeing if I have some birthday luck with NRL Traders Packs. I've got five here to open. I uh, will hopefully pull something pretty cool. Um, I do have a couple more put aside for a pack battle in the near future. I've also got to uh, order another box so I can do a box battle and then a couple of other really cool things coming up and then obviously the uh, elites will be coming out soon so look out for all that a lot of good things to come on this channel so hit that subscribe button down below and yeah let's see if we can get a cool pull from this and hit the like button to wish me a happy birthday that's how I can see that you wish me a happy birthday let's get into this first one here let me know your predictions down below in the comments and let's just crack on to the first pack here. Now I am getting pretty close to completing near everything for um, the traders that is easy to collect so I'm probably going to, other than the pack battles and box battles and stuff like that, probably going to slow down uh, trading cards but when the elites pick back up or pick up and drop I will definitely be um, doing a lot of those for you guys. So, the first card is a Moses Leota Panthers uh, Platinum Parallel. And our first card is, I'm going to say a Rep Star? No, it is a Dud Pack. So, a Dud Pack for my first birthday pack. Not very good, but at least we didn't end off with that one. So, let's just move on to the next one here. So, top, bottom, top, bottom, and then middle for the last pack to see how we can go for today. Hopefully I can pull something cool out of this. Um, be very cool to pull something cool on my birthday. So we've got Wade Graham from the Sharks at the Platinum Parallel and we've also got a Star Toon. I don't think I've got this Star Toon. Um, give me a second, let me go get my um, checklist. Alright, so I've got my checklist here and it turns out I do have it just from looking at the side of the card I could tell what team it was. And it is, in fact, let me pull these cards out of the way. A little bit upsetting. That is a duplicate, but um, that is the, that is the um, pack life. You don't know what you're going to get. It's the joy of opening packs. And it is a Anthony Milford star tune right there. That you guys can see. So, if you guys need an Anthony Milford star tune, and you've got a star tune I need, I'll quickly go over the star tunes I need. So... I still need a Joey Leilua, a um, Cam Smith, Mitchell Pierce, uh, Mike Asiva, Isaiah Yo, Cam McKinnis, Boyd Cordner, um, Star Tunes. I'm pretty sure I left out the ones that I'm hopefully trading, or well, pretty much have traded for already, and any of the group ones, but obviously they're a lot rarer, so I don't expect them. But if you guys want an Anthony Milford, let me know. Either Instagram me or email me. That's the best way to get into contact for trades. So I'm definitely open to trades now for um, traders to help uh, finish off my collection. Yeah, so that's going to go top, bottom, top, bottom. So let's grab the bottom one out, not the top one. Let's crack into this. So one dud pack, one duplicate. Not too good luck so far, but it can all change with just one packet, guys. So we have a... Bane of my existence, Rabbitohs Platinum, Platinum Parallel Checklist is stupid the amount of those I have. And the rare is a Jai Arrow, um, which one's this? 13. I don't have this card, a Jai Arrow Magic Round. Very happy with that. Um, number 13, just to, just to triple check, Jai Arrow number 13, 13, yeah, I don't have him. So 166 meters, 32 tackles in 67 minutes. In the Magic Round last year. Yeah, very happy to collect that. Obviously, um, the least, like, um, I'll say common rares I have. Magic Rounds is the lowest because it is the lowest uh, pull rate. But, yeah, I'm very happy that I pulled a new Magic Round. It's been something I've really wanted to try and complete because it, it does seem difficult to complete the Magic Rounds. So... Very happy there to pull that one. We move on to the second last pack. 
can we continue that little luck streak that we have? So we have a Latrell Mitchell Platinum Parallel and we have a Latrell Mitchell Rep Star. So two Latrell Mitchells. Let's actually see if there's any Latrell Mitchell in here as well. There's James Desco, but there is no Latrell Mitchell normal common card. So Latrell Mitchell for the Indigenous All-Stars, I already have. So if you guys need Latrell Mitchell, let me know. We can try trade. I think I've only need Tyrone Roberts for the Indigenous, Indigenous All-Stars. So that'll be a pretty cool trade to do. As we move on to this very last pack here, guys. Hopefully, hopefully we can pull something really cool. Um, but we'll have to see, obviously. So we've got a John Asiata Platinum Parallel. And the rare is, there's no sticker, there's no texture, so I'm not thinking it's a street art. It is a rep star. There's a blues rep star. I need a Blake Ferguson, Mitchell Pierce, or Tom Trevojevic. Can it be one of those? Let's, let's reveal it together here, guys. It is a, you guys have to get to see it first. Hopefully it is a card I need. It is a Tom Trevojevic. I needed that. Oi. So, two cards I needed, two cards I didn't need, but still, tradables for you guys is the Latrell Mitchell and the Anthony Milford. So if you guys need either of those cards, let me know. And we can try and sort out our trade, like I said. Instagram DMs or emails, they can be found down below in the description. So go check that out to get in contact and um, sort all that out. And then the two cards I needed, Tom Trevojevic and Jai Arrow as the rep star and the uh, magic round. So I'll read out the Tom Trevojevic if you guys don't know the little stuff in the back. So his position was center. He's had five rep matches. His debut was in 2018 game one. Trevojevic returned from injury to play a starring role for the New South Wales Blues in the final two matches of the series, highlighted by his hat-trick of tries against the Queensland Maroons in Perth. Had a very, very good game, that game. He's definitely a very big future star. So guys, if you did enjoy this, hit that like button. Comment down below uh, if you guys need to trade, but like I said, Definitely Instagram or give me a uh, email to confirm trades. And yeah, the from what I'm aware of, the Corey Harawira Naira, if it isn't uh, still available, I, sorry, the Corey Harawira Naira, the Payne Haas Bronze Authentic. Check the description. I'll put in there if it's still not available. But if you guys want to trade for the Payne Haas Bronze Signature, that is still available. Uh, the first person that commented on it. Uh, hasn't been able to get back to me in nearly a week, so I'm passing on to anyone else that wants to try and get it. Um, yeah, so that should be pretty cool for you guys to try to get hands on. And yeah, subscribe because there's a lot of uh, cool stuff coming up. And then once the elites come out, I'll be diving into them and I'll be seeing what I can do with that. I'm hoping to get a case, but I'm not too sure money wise how much they're going to cost, and I'm assuming they'll cost a lot, so um. I'll see what I can do, but no promises, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!